Uh, Andy Stavropoulos, I'm 25 and I make music, DJ, and do a bunch of other audio things. My name's Natalie, I am 27 years old and I design women's denim for a pretty big fashion retailer. I don't think so. Nah. How long have you been skating for? Uh, I've been skating a little bit over a year. And what got you turned on to it? Uh, I just thought the attitude and like the culture was kind of cool. And I work in fashion, so it's like the fashion of it and like all that kind of stuff. Like the look of it, it's cool. Do you have a type? Not, not, not really. No, no type. What's usually your type? My type usually goes towards like creatives, but just whoever, like whatever they do, if they can get really into it and like get really nerdy about it, like that's cool. So if it was yeah. a bank, you would date a banker if he was just really If he was like super weird into it, yeah. What do you consider the best Uh, I mean, I have some pretty sick shoes. Kind of fly. <laughs> I'm not that much of a sneakerhead either. I don't want to sound like a fucker. <laughs> My best feature, I think, is that I get along with everyone and I'm pretty like giggly and like it's not, hard to like be friends with me. What would be like a good date for you? <laughs> um, I think a good date for me would be when I'm actually interested in like what they're talking about and stuff at the end of the day. <laughs> and what would be a good date for you? Uh, I mean, one where I don't fuck everything up. Do you think size matters? Like, what kind of <laughs> No, I don't think it does. <laughs> Are you nervous at all? Yeah, I'm pretty nervous. I always get nervous before dates. <laughs> hey, what's up? Hey, nice to meet you. What's your name? I'm Natalie. Natalie. What's up? Nice Andy, to meet you. Nice to meet you. What's hey. Up? How you doing? <laughs> I'm good. How are you? What's up? I'm going to tell my four times. I know. <laughs> all good, all good. Where are you from originally? I'm from Greenpoint. Well, originally from Indiana, the uh, Midwest. Right. Yeah. How about you? I uh, was born here originally. Cool. So, <laughs> what, you playing music? Yeah. Cool. Yeah, I like work out of a studio on Christie Street. Oh, cool. I used to live in Chinatown. Is it super whack if I have a cigarette in my beanie? No. Nah. Okay. <laughs> right, Thank you. <laughs>
I'll dress up differently, like if I know I'm going to skate. I think it's cool that uh, like I'm on a date as the non-skater with a skater chick. Flip the script a little bit. Do you ever get intimidated when you tell guys that you skate? Yes. <laughs> I think guys expect a lot. Or they're like, can you kick flip? Or like, they just kind of want me to show off that I can do it. I don't need to do that for anyone, really. Like, What kind of went down at the spot? So we came in, had a couple shots. We, we were vibing for sure. Talking about uh, horoscopes, parents. Trying to like talk about your parents, but not get too in depth and like make it weird on your like first date. You know, you start talking about your dad, your mom. It's like, oh. like, oh. <laughs> like, oh, like maybe like you know. Don't give it all the way on the first date. Leave a little bit to be desired. Do you think he's into you? Yeah, I think he's into me. I think she's into you. I mean, I think earlier on in the date she was. Now I don't know. I had a couple of whiskey neats, a couple more drinks deeper. Maybe it's not the best look, but it's my look. Do you think she's hotter because she can skate? Yeah, definitely. I think 100%. Probably 100%. 98 to 100. What would you rate her when you met her, and what do you rate her now? I'd say like a like a seven to a to a, a nine. I mean, like I said, I'm kind of judgmental, so it's probably seven to a nine. Because she's pretty fucking cool. She's a cool girl. How is the date going now that you've spent more time together? Yeah, uh, now that we've spent more time together, it's going well. I could see us being like cool friends and stuff, yeah. I just think it's a matter of chemistry. Like, I mean, he's cool and we get along great, but like, you know, at a certain point, you feel something else. Would you continue the date from here? Yeah, I think so. I don't know if it would go well from here if I keep drinking and we keep, but yeah, I think I would continue. Lastly, would you continue the day from here? Uh, n from here, I've got some friends who are out and stuff. I think I might rather spend some time with them instead of continue, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> you think you learned? Right, yeah. Nope, nope. Were you shook that he went ham on the shots? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think I might have been there with him too. Yeah. I might have done one more extra that you didn't do. Did you? Two? Was it one? Maybe none. Yeah, but I had him put some in my drink, too. Oh, uh, yeah, true. What are you guys doing now? Are you guys going to continue the date, or you think you're good? I mm. mean, I got to I gotta work tomorrow. Yeah, you got to be up. Yeah. Yeah, I got to be uh, maybe, up. Maybe at another... I'm a responsible person. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a good way to be. Yeah. It's good to be responsible. Is it? Me, I don't have work tomorrow, so... Might not go home. Should spin some, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. <Sick. laughs>